Good morning, guys. Who else is crazy enough to get up and do an eight kilometer walk at eight o'clock, excuse me, six o'clock in the morning on a Sunday? Hmm. Anyways, listen, I got a phone call last night. Thank God I didn't answer it from one of my clients who said, you know, Chris, do you not like me anymore? Did, did I make you mad? I was like, huh? What are you talking about? We're listing his condo for sale in San Francisco. And the guy emails us probably four times a day. And one of the things that I did wrong, that I screwed up, is I did not establish up front how often we're going to communicate, how we're going to communicate, and how often is needed. And that is my fault. And that's one of the things we should always do with all of our real estate clients. Set a precedent, tell them up front, very, you know, very frankly, this is how we're going to communicate. How do you want me to communicate with you? Do you want phone calls, texts, emails? And I never had that conversation with him. So he sends me a shit gram voicemail <laughs> last night at midnight, believe it or not, telling me that um, we haven't talked in a day and that he was wondering if I was mad at him and blah, 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 which I'm not, of course. But I should have set that conversation up very at the very beginning of our relationship. So let's make sure we do that so you don't get shit of grams at 12 o'clock midnight on a Saturday night. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope that you have a brilliant Sunday. I hope that uh, go out, do your eight kilometer walk, have a, an amazing Sunday. Like this video, follow me, check out the link below, and you be kind to yourselves. Ciao.